Hello, here's how I dyed that chalk. So first I'm starting with ProSource chalk. Here I am showing you all the colors that I like to use. The color splash one has been the best so far. It's that purple that everybody's loving. So I always start with a dark color first. This is the purple that everybody loves. I'm just putting it in a spot on the chalk, not covering the whole thing, just letting it soak in. And then I'm gonna go in with green next on the other ones. And these are not mixed with any water. It's just plain dye. I'm very slow at pouring. Next I go in with the yellow and I pour it on top of that dark color I just poured. It kind of like pushes it into the chalk if that makes sense, the other color. I also let each color absorb into the block before I pour another color. And I usually like to go dark light, dark light. Sometimes I'll do dark on dark, just depends. So this right here is a new color I have not used before. Um, it definitely needed to be watered down. That's why I didn't use much of it. Going in with another dark color on top of that yellow. And I don't cover the whole block. I just pour wherever. So it kind of looks like you know, uneven layers on the inside. And this is orange. I do eventually cover the whole block with color. This is just where I'm trying to soak it into the middle. All right, this is the blue. <coughs> I poured on top of that thicker color just to see if it would help it absorb more. It, it never did. This is a teal color. It looks green, but it dries teal. Just kind of sprinkling it on there. I'm very messy with this. I'm not neat or perfect. I flipped them all over. Now I'm going in with a dark color again. I like to start with a dark color. I don't know how it would be if you started with a light color, but I, I've, I just start with a dark color. I forgot to flip that one. <clears throat> now this is pink. The squirt bottles are so much easier to use. I did forget to say what brand this is. I'll put it in my description. I forgot I had it, I just found it. with the pink because I wanted the pink to show more blue this is just the um, color splash that's and it's watered down this one is watered down but it's still very blue push those colors in. I don't know if that's what it's really doing. I just feel like that's what it's doing. <laughs> um, this one's orange. I just alternate between each color. Dark light, dark light. I wish I would have used more purple, but hopefully that purple that I put first will really stand out. At this point, I'm trying to just get the whole block covered in dye. Pink. Green. This color splash dye is 
pretty nice. I just wish they had more color options. I haven't seen more than just the purple, green, blue, yellow, and orange and red. And that's it. I will show you it dried after this. Bye. Okay, here they are. Um, I planned on recording breaking them in half and showing you, but I didn't press record when I was breaking them. My luck. Um, but here they are. They are very purpley, bluey. Um, if you wanted to do different colors, I would stay away from the purples and blues. Um, just because they are overpowering. Um, but yeah, here they are.